What is going on football fans? I am back at it with another video and today I'm going to be doing a film review on DeAndre Baker. Now what I did was I found some of his best highlight clips where he went up against some of the best players in college football. One game was against Missouri where Drew Locke is of course the quarterback. Another game he was going up against Debo Samuel, one of the uh, top tier talented wide receivers in this year's draft out of South Carolina. Um, this, of course, takes into account a lot of his other games, and you're going to see a lot of the things that I really like about this kid and why the Giants took him 30th overall. Of course, they traded back up into the first round to get this kid, and DeAndre Baker was the first cornerback taken in this year's draft. He's a little undersized. He doesn't quite have the speed of some of the uh, top athletes that play the position, but he is just a gamer, great football player, great instincts. Big time tackler, and he's just tough football. You're going to see him play some zone. You're going to see him play some man coverage. Um, yeah, you're going to see a lot. You're going to see all of it in these clips, and we're going to jump right into it. So, without further ado, here we go. I'm going to I'm going to step out for a second, guys. So here we are in this first clip, and here is DeAndre Baker right there. This is DeAndre Baker here. He's kind of in like a zone coverage as he's reading the defense, and we're going to jump right into it. And they got a man in motion. He's going to hand off. He's going to throw back to the quarterback. And look at Baker stay at home and absolutely blow up that play. And he's got the air guitar going. You'll see that that seems to be his uh, celebratory move there every time he makes a big play. But just great instincts here by Baker as he stays at home, does not fall for the fake. Now, here we go. This is a replay of that play. So they've got mo – he's, he's on an island by himself right here. He's on an island by himself. And the offensive line, as you see, they are blocking as if the play is going to go this way. And it fakes out most of the defense. But DeAndre Baker stays at home. Let's let this play develop. So look at this. Everybody is going this way. Everybody is attacking the ball. Right? Baker's the only guy left. If Baker collapses, this is a touchdown. He's the only guy left. He's on an island by himself. He throws back to the quarterback, and Baker is there for the play. He absolutely destroys that play, and just an unbelievable play there by DeAndre Baker. So here we are, another play from that same game. Mid-Tennessee coming out in the shotgun formation. We're going to let this play develop. Let's see what happens now. It's a fourth and nine, and this is going to be Baker right here, being in the zone coverage. Obviously, they got to get here. they got a trips formation left. Here comes the play. Looking to his right, and picked off by DeAndre Baker. We're going to get another view at this. Um, Baker, of course, playing center field there, knew that they had to get those nine yards as it was a fourth and nine situation, and he just jumps the route and runs back for about 30 yards, and you saw that air guitar again. Maybe this guy's a musician. Uh, I don't know. But uh, we're going to get another look at this. Okay, so this is going to be the receiver right here that is going to get the target. Baker's out of the picture right now. He's Like I said, he's playing center field in zone coverage. Here's the yard mark for the first down. He's turning around, and here's Baker getting ready to jump the route. Reads the quarterback's eyes and just absolutely jumps the route for, a, for an easy pick. Uh, just a great job there reading the play, reading the quarterback's eyes by DeAndre Baker. Had a hell of a game this day, right? Same game. He blew up that play earlier, and now he jumps it for a pick. I'm um, just showing you the tools that this guy has. Here we are in another play against Mid-Tennessee State. So here's Baker here, closest to us on the screen. Looks like they're coming out with a... Uh, Trips wide left formation out of the shotgun. And let's see how this play develops. Baker in zone coverage. Drops, throws a screen. And look at Baker come up. And oh, he strips that ball out of his hand. This is all in the same game. We're going to get a replay of this. Reminds me of Charles Tillman from the Bears. He used to do that all the time. The great cornerback. So here we go. Here's Baker right here, number 18. Look at his left hand. Gets it in there and strips that ball right out of there and causes that fumble. What a day he had in this game. All right, so here we go here. This is against Missouri and Drew Locke. And Baker is going to be here on the far sideline as they are right around the their own 25-yard line getting set to start their drive as Georgia Lee is 13-7 in this ballgame. And here comes Locke, takes the snap, play action pass. Look at Baker force the wide receiver to the outside. That is great coverage. Great coverage. And then he talks a little smack after he gets in his face. That's what you're supposed to do. You're supposed to take away the inside of the football field if you're a cornerback. Um, obviously, limits the catch radius. So here we go again. Here we are, shotgun formation. And Baker again on the uh, far side right there, right around the 40-yard line. 
as he's matched up against the same wide receiver. And Locke's going to take the snap. And he's looking, looking, and throwing, and just great coverage. He's all over him. All over him. Smothering him. Great coverage there by Baker. This is why we drafted this kid. So here we go. Here's the next play. Second and five. Baker's closest to us on this play, right around the 45-yard line. And Locke again in the shotgun. Takes the snap. And they're going to run. Look at the anticipation here. Baker, oh, with a nice little shoulder-to-shoulder uh, -shoulder tackle, pushes him out of bounds. And if you look back here just a couple of seconds, he's able to fight off the blocker. That's the most impressive part about this play. That is the most. Let me, let me see if I can bring this back just a tad. So look at this here. Why, this, is, this is obviously a design run play. Wide receiver is going to block Baker, going to try to take him out of the picture to get a big gain here. And look at Baker fight off this block. Look at him. Look at him. Fight it off. Fight it off. Finish the play. Good job there by DeAndre Baker. Talking a little smack. All right, so here we go. Here's the next play. And Baker is, again, going to be on the far hash right here, right around that 50-yard line. And in this game, they're playing Tennessee. Coming out in the shotgun. Got uh, four wide receivers set. And he takes the snap. Looks. Drops. Throws. And Oh! What a play there by B uh, DeAndre Baker. There's the uh, air guitar again to break that play up. Threw him over his head. I'm sure we're going to see a replay of this. But again, great anticipation skills by Baker. You see the closing speed. And here, here's a better camera angle here. Baker kind of in like his own coverage here. And he's going to drop back and watch the anticipation. He sees the receiver about to break his route to come back for the ball. And you see how he stops his feet. Now he's getting ready to pounce. And there it is. There's the pounce. There's the pounce. Ball's coming. Look at that closing speed. Look at that closing speed to break up that play. Great job there by Baker. Beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Great technique. Didn't get there too early. All right, so here's our next play here. And there's Baker right there, right around the 30-yard line. And again, they're kind of in, a, I guess, like a zone. And he's dropping back. It's a third and eight, so obviously they got to get to that orange hash there. Drops back to pass, three-step drop, good coverage, and that time they complete it, but Baker makes him pay. <laughs> Looks like the Baker, Baker, uh, DeAndre Baker, and I think the safety absolutely wallop this guy over the middle. Let's take a look here. Again, you're seeing that closing speed, though. Now, he got there a little late, got there a little late, was able to break the zone, but uh, Baker delivers a hit there, and actually it looks like Callaway had to come out of the game. So here we are here, uh, two-point conversion. On the goal line. And here's Baker right there. Right around where the end zone is. Um, let's see what he does here in this play to break this up. Drops back to pass. Looking to his right. And once again, Baker just all over the wide receiver. There's a little celebration. Getting in the coach's face a little bit. No, 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 no. So Baker just smothering him here. And here we go. Next play here. Baker is closest to us right here. On this play here. Coming out of the shotgun. Let's see what he does. Second and nine. Drops back. Quick throw. And once again, Baker breaks that play up. And if you watch, I'm pretty sure if we watch this in slow motion, Baker's right arm breaks this play up. Otherwise, this is going to be a catch. Let's look at the technique here. Drops back to pass. There's the throw. All right. Ball's midair. Here's the closing speed. Look at Baker. Look at Baker collapsing. There's the arm. You see the arm? Gets the arm in there, and he's able to poke that ball out. Just great. Great defense there by DeAndre Baker. Here's the next play. Shotgun drops back to pass. Kind of missed Baker on this one, but let's see what happens. I think that's Shermer's son. And right over the middle there again, good coverage. But I think they were able to complete that. But I think if I, if I remember correctly when I watched this, Baker does a great job of getting his hand in there. Just an unbelievable catch by the tight end, and you're going to see it here in slow motion. DeAndre Baker's all over. Look at this. All over him. Gets the hand in there. And somehow he just comes up with a catch. But that's great technique. Great defense. He just caught it. So here we are now. Next play. Baker looks like he's up in press coverage. And good coverage down the field. And again, just absolutely smothering. They get a completion. But I mean, he had a lot, a lot of time for that route to develop. And Baker stuck with him the whole way. This guy's a beast. Here's the replay. Look at this coverage. Look at his coverage. Won't let him get to the outside. Won't let him complete the route. He fights for five, and he's still trying to get that ball out. 
So here we are. Next play here, DeAndre Baker. He's right here closest to us on the screen. Shotgun formation drops back to pass. Baker looks. And that time I think Baker got beat. I think it was a zone coverage. Maybe he missed his assignment. Uh, I think we're going to get to see a replay here. Let's see. Looking down the field. Baker, yeah, Baker was on 83. I, maybe the safety came over late. It's hard to tell. Um, but they, they found a hole in the zone there. And here we are again. Baker closest to us once again here on the 1st and 10 on the 45. Shotgun formation. Drops back. Looks. And once again, look. Look at how good to be able to be that physical without committing a penalty. I mean, he is all over this guy. And you will see later in the film, by the way. Here's another play. Baker was closest to us again. Good coverage. Trying to improvise there, and he's, he has to throw it away. But you will see later in the film that Baker does get a little too physical sometimes. That's a weakness of his. He does commit some penalties, but this guy's a physical receiver. He breaks up the timing of the routes, and here he is again, closest to us right here. Shotgun formation. Drops back. Looks. He forces him to the outside, and look at him get the hand in there. Oh, that is pretty. Where's the air guitar, Baker? There's no air guitar in that play. You got to break out the air guitar. That was beautiful. Making a play for the ball. Little contact, but reaches in that left hand and pokes that away. Great play there by DeAndre Baker. And that receiver's got at least a couple inches on him. Just a great play. He's pumped. He's pumped up. So let's see what we got here. Next play. I think Baker is on the far sideline here, if I'm not mistaken. Let's take a look. Shotgun. Play action pass. Actually, it looks like they run. They fooled me. There's the run. Bounces it to the outside. And look at Baker finish with the shoulder. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Let's take a look at that finish again. I like that. I like the physicality out of my corners. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. There he is. A little pop. Oh, a little pop. I love it. Love it. Here's another angle from it. So uh, here's the safety. He's the guy who actually initially makes the contact when he bounces it to the outside. And there's Baker right behind him. Boom! Come get some. Next play, that was a little quick, but I think this is Baker here on the 40. Drops back, quick slant, and it's completed, but again, all over him. And he gets his hand in there to try to break that up. You saw him get his left hand in there trying to break that up. And here's a play-action pass. Let's see what Baker does here. Looks, cooks, throws off the back foot... And Baker's all over him. No, no one there. Maybe, maybe there's a flag there. He's complaining for one, but I don't see it. Don't see it there, Marshall Baker. Baker getting into it. And here's DeAndre here, right around that 10-yard line. In uh, looks to be press coverage. Play action pass. Looks, throws to the left sideline. Broken up. Baker again able to use that leverage, get that right hand in there again. Same receiver as last time. Um, saved, saved the touchdown there. Of course, Baker did not give up a touchdown for the last two years, and here's a better angle of it. Look at him get that right hand up there and just break that up. Got the hand right right in front of the eyes. Couldn't do much. And here he is again. This time he's backing off here in the second and 10 on the far hash. Oh, no. All right. That was just a replay. All right. So let's see what happens here. Quick throw, and that should have been picked off. Looks like Baker had an easy pick there, dropped it, but once again, all over his wide receiver. Not the best throws there. Um, trying to get that out. And, yeah, that's just a misthrown ball, but he was all over Jefferson. And then a little extracurricular activity after that. And here's the next play. Play action. Oh, there's a run. And there's Baker again in on that play. Give him, give him a half a tackle. Good improv skills there. All right, so next play here. This is the game against Debo Samuel. And if I'm not mistaken, let me move this down just a tad. I think Baker's here on the far hash. He backs off zone coverage, looks down the field, and that's just a completion. They break the zone there. Not much Baker did there. Samuel, one of the best receivers in football. And there's a triple sets left. Baker's going to be somewhere around here. I think he's there right around that 40. Again, zone coverage. And again, very tight coverage. And he's able to he's able to break that up yet again. Great job there by Deion. Ooh, look at the cheerleaders. So here we go. Third and two. There's Baker again. Man coverage down the sideline. 
And they're going to call him for a flag on this play. I don't know if I saw it, to be honest with you. But again, you saw a great technique there by Baker to force him to the outside. Limit that catch radius. Um, but this was a great battle all game when you looked at the film between him and Samuel. Um, just a great battle. And this was arguably Baker's best game of the year. And, yeah, again, forcing him to run to the outside. But I think, they, yeah, they call him for a pass interference on in that play. But it, it was debatable. Once again, this guy is going to commit some penalties. He is a physical receiver. Here's a better look at it. Forced him that out. Yeah, he, put, he shoved him a little bit. I don't know if that's a catchable ball, though. Is that catchable? So here we go. Second and ten. Baker's here. Uh, the far, the farthest guy from us, right along that sideline. And this is going to be zone coverage. And this is going to be a play where I think Baker comes up with a pick six. Let's take a look. Shotgun formation drops back to pass. Looks. Throws. And batted up in the air, and there's Baker, comes up with it, and he's going to run this all the way back for a touchdown. However, he does drop it on the one-yard line. His own player did recover this, and they get credit for the touchdown, and there's the air guitar. There's the air guitar again, he's breaking it out, little little Jimi Hendrix. But again, great anticipation skills by Baker. Ball gets batted up in the air, picks that up, runs, with, runs for about 50 yards for the score. But they'll show in the replay that he actually drops this before he crosses the end zone. There he is, getting, getting in, getting in uh, the uh, South Carolina player's face right there. This is all in the first minute of this game, by the way. And there it is, batted up in the air. And look at him break, break coverage there and just run that back. Like a track star down the sideline. Love it. Love it. I'm showing the extra point for some reason. Okay. 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 I think they show the replay where he drops it, too. Yeah, there it is. There's, there's the pylon cam. And look at him drop it right on the half-yard line. Luckily, his teammate is able to uh, pick that up for the score. So uh, that's all in the first minute, like we said. And we're going to get back to game action. Here we are. Second and nine. And I think he's on the far hash again right near that 25-yard line. Shotgun formation matched up on Samuel. Drops back to pass. Again, you notice. You notice what he does there. And he's physical again. He's going to get hit for another flag. But again, the technique is there. He forces Samuel to the outside. Does not give up the inside part of the field. Um, gets hit with a flag there. He was uh, he was on top of him. Yeah. Yeah. You, so, you see him holding the jersey there. But that's, what, that's the type of guy he is. He's a physical corner. That's going to happen from time to time. See if we can jump ahead to the next play. And we just missed it. Hold on, let me go back a second. All right, let's just wait for the next play here. All right, so here we go. Same thing. He's going to be right around that 30. Drops back to pass. Looks, throws, and that's batted up in the air for what should have been an interception. DeAndre Baker pretty much caused what should have been an interception there. Um, but his player was not able to come up with it. But again, unbelievable coverage against one of the best wide receivers in football. Look at him get his hand in there. Bat that up. And that could have been an easy pick. Look at this. Look at that replay. Oh, he gets the left hand in there. That is nice, DeAndre. Great job there by Bake. This is why we took this guy in the first round, ladies and gentlemen. So here we go. Uh, fakes the throw. Pumps. Throws. And on this play, Bake gets beat a little bit. It is. He had some help over the top with the safety there. But Debo does beat him on the move. But he knew he had help. So he knew he could be aggressive. So let's take a look here. He tries to, you know what happened there, I think? I think Baker tries to disrupt the timing of the route, and he just whiffs on the contact. So sometimes when you're aggressive, there are there are penalties, but he did not get, he didn't have to, uh, he didn't get killed on that one. So here he is on the uh, far hash again. Shotgun, and looks like he's able to get the inside of the field this time, and Baker comes up with a tackle. Good close coverage there again, and he got... He, he gets two tackles for that. He brought down the referee as well. And that was the third and long. So they held him there. Shotgun drops back to pass again. Thrown. Tight coverage. Caught. And look at Baker. You want to talk about a physical corner. If you catch a ball on this guy, he's going to make you feel it. He's going to make you feel it. Samuel goes up for the catch. And Baker says, oh, you're, you're going to have to pay for that. Great technique there. Shoulder to shoulder. Throws him down. And there's the cheerleader again. Here we go, shotgun formation, drops back, quick throw, and Baker again, nice sound tackle. They do get the first on that play. 
12.52. Baker closest to us on the field. And again, Samuel gets uh, gets a catch there for about 7 or 8 yards. But you see he's not getting anything after the catch. He is all over him on every one of these plays. And here's going to be a second and eight. Baker once again closest to us right around that 33-yard line. Shotgun formation. Drops back. Looks. Baker. Unbelievable anticipation skills. He's matched up on Samuel. That's not his assignment. Let's go back and look at this. He's matched up on Samuel. Right? Right here. That's his assignment. This running back right here is going to be the guy that gets the ball. Baker's matched up on Samuel over here right around, I don't know, the 40-yard line. Drops back, hits his running back, and look at the anticipation by Baker. And the finish. That is great. That is a great play by Baker. So here we are. Baker once again closest to us right around the 25. Press coverage. Look, scans the field, throws a deep ball down the sideline, and... Once again, Baker does not allow the inside part of the field. Good coverage. No interception there. Just, just good coverage there. Good sound coverage by Baker. And he just got walloped, didn't he? All right, so same thing. Closest to us, Baker. And play action pass. He's going to roll out, trying to buy time, and he's just got to get rid of it. Um, just good coverage there all around, looked like. So here we go. Shotgun formation. Oh, they're showing the replay. So here's what Baker did. Look at him. Look at the physicality. He is all over him like white on rice. Guy's unbelievable. So here we go. I think he's furthest from us here right around the 50-yard line against Kentucky. Shotgun drops back. And again, forcing him to the outside. And they hit him for a flag there. Gets hit for a flag there for some uh, contact down the field. But you still see the technique. You still see that he's all over him. He's not giving up. He's not giving up much space. Here's a, good, a better look. If anything, you know what? That might have been a flag on Kentucky. He initiated the contact. I think that's a flag on Kentucky. That's ridiculous. If they didn't, if they call that on Baker, that's ridiculous. Just great coverage there. And they're gonna give it another view here. Look at he's got he's he's looking at the ball. He gets pulled down. I, I'll tell you the wide receiver. That's a heads up play though to draw that penalty. So here we go. Baker's gonna be right here. I think in press coverage. It looks like they got a two wide receiver set. This is against Jared Stidham of Auburn, who was drafted this year. Drops back the pass and he's getting blocked. He's able to fight off the block. And there's another penalty there. I think horse collar tackle. Yeah, we we know DeAndre Baker gets physical. We know he gets physical, guys. <laughs> Once in a while, you're gonna get hit with those with him. But he's able to fight off that blocker and make the tackle. This guy's a football player. He's not a prima donna. This guy's a football player. Hear my dog back in, uh, barking in the background. Apologize about that, guys. So here we go. Baker's going to be closest to us on this play. Drops back to pass. Throws a quick screen. And look at the open field tackle. Shoestring tackle. Great, great tackle there by DeAndre Baker. Shotgun formation. Baker closest to us. Throws. And once again, great coverage. Able to get his left hand in there to break up the pass right around the 40-yard line. He says, no, no, no. So here we go. I think in this play, Baker's going to be furthest from us. Right around that 13-yard line. Shotgun. Stidham. Drops back to pass. And he gives up. He gives it up that time. He's able to tackle him. But gave him some space there. Not the best of coverage. Let's take a look. Yeah, he gets beat to the inside. Got beat to the inside there. So here we go. Shotgun formation drops back. This time, uh, Baker falls on his feet. And he was beat there. Stidham just misses the target. Let's take a look. Yeah, that's... I mean, that's not really a highlight for DeAndre Baker. He fell. Here we go. Shotgun formation. Drops back. Looks. Scans the field. And great covers there once again. No but no room there to catch that ball. And he's showing it to you from all facets. He's doing it always. Man press. Zone coverage. Um, he could be physical. He could do... And they call another penalty. Was this on Baker again? 
They do hit him for another defensive pass interference. All right, all right. He'll learn. And this time, I think he was in zone coverage. And a quick out, quick completion. So Baker's getting beat here in this game a little bit. So here we go. Baker on the far hash. Shotgun formation. Drops back to pass. Again, you notice he forced him to the outside. And nowhere to go there. And another flag! Was he really that physical? I don't think that was catchable. That's what his that's what his teammate's saying. I don't think that was a catchable pass. And I, I think if I remember correctly, they do rule it an uncatchable ball. Yeah, and they do. All right, so no penalty there. And just great coverage there by Baker to force him to the outside. So here we go. Um... Not too sure where he is. I think he's on the uh, far, the closest to us, but you can't see him right now on this play. Drops back to pass. Throws over the middle. Caught. And that's Andy Isabella, the quick slot wide receiver. Beat Baker there over the middle. Andy Isabella is a really talented wide receiver out of UMass. And here's a better look at it. Isabella over the middle. And I think Baker was there in uh, zone coverage. Drops back to pass. Throws. Isabella over the middle. And a great shoestring tackle there by Baker. So if Baker doesn't make this play, let's take a look. You got at least another 10 yards here. At least another 10 yards here. Look at this. Here's Baker. If he whiffs on this tackle, maybe maybe 30 comes up for the tackle, but he's able to hold him there for a third down. Uh, great play there by DeAndre Baker with the left hand. Great technique. Here's a better angle. Nice play. Open field tackle. That is pretty. And here we go, shotgun formation, play action. This is Alabama. Tua throwing down the middle, wide open there. They break the zone, and Baker comes over and help. I'll tell you, another great tackle. That was not his man. A great tackle there uh, by the shoestrings once again in the open field. Looks like Baker got hurt a little bit on that play. Yeah, this is just zone coverage. They bust the zone, and Baker comes over to help and might have saved a touchdown with this tackle, really. I mean, that, that's beautiful technique. Great tackle. I'm sure he's okay. He got drafted the first round. He's going he's to be okay, guys. I promise. Shotgun. This time he was in zone coverage, it looked like. Tua drops back, buys some time. Looks down the field, throws, and again he drops a pick. But he was there. That should have been picked off. Baker just misses an opportunity there for a potential maybe pick six. Uh, you got to catch that, Baker. Come on. Come on, DeAndre. Oh, God. Oh, God. Hits both hands. Come down with that. Oh, man. So here we go. Drops back to pass. Throws. And caught. Let's see if he makes a good tackle here. And again, you see, he gets him on the shoes again. Very hard to break tackles from this guy. This is what I said when he's a good football player. Two again. Drops back to pass. Play action. Steps up. Throws. And that's a catch, but that's great coverage. Got both hands in there, tried to break it up. He was all over rugs on that play. Didn't give him an inch. And I think that's going to do it, guys. I think that wraps it up. That is DeAndre Baker's film review. So I'll pop back in. So what you saw in here out of DeAndre Baker, extremely physical corner he has great anticipation skills and i'm really looking forward to see what he does with the new york giants great technique he's just a great great football player as always guys if you liked what you watched please subscribe drop a comment maybe give me a little thumbs up cheers